today we're gonna do something that's a little bit more adventurous than what we normally do. I'm not sure if it's suitable for doing it with a baby. Zakaria disagrees. But nevertheless, we're Field of Visions and we're gonna give it a try. Just after sunrise, we've not been awake for this time early for a long time. <laughs> we had to wake the guru up, and luckily, he wasn't screaming the place down when we woke him up. But come on, let's go! Let's go! More will be revealed in a few moments where we're going, but it is 6 30 in the morning, and our lovely Airbnb host has kindly offered to take us all the way to our next stop here, hoping it's going to be amazing. It's going to be a comfy ride. Shall we go? Yep, sure. let's go. Guys, we've just parked up now here and we are gonna make an attempt to go to the tower. We've heard things that, you know, it's not hard, it's not that difficult, it's quite easy, but then other reviews online have said it's very dangerous and scary and it's tough. Yeah, so I'm not sure what it's like, but all I know is I can see it right there at it's the top. very high. In the distance, you can see it just there. When you get here, you can either walk 1.5 kilometers to the main attraction or get a lovely tuk-tuk here, which we're gonna do. We're gonna take the easy option, aren't we, this morning? Yes, we are. Let's go. We've made it to the top. There looks like there's six of the tuk-tuks here, which only means there may be other people here too that got the right idea about coming yeah. early. But look at these monkeys. Look at all these uh, monkeys, just literally loads of them. It's so a nice little morning walk we're doing. But you still got to do a few steps, which is not too shabby. One thing to note, it is a bit cool up here. So a nice little hoodie would have done, done the trick. We've got to climb all that way up. Wonder what it's going to be like up there. Yeah, so you've got this tower. And it looks like you've got a couple of other towers as well. You've got that one there hmm. and the one behind it. Are you ready for the next bit of uh, climbing up? I think so. I'm scared. Bali! <laughs> okay, let's go to the top, guys. It's not that bad so Quack. far. Yeah. So far. <laughs> so far, we literally like two steps in. It's not bad, obviously. Well, obviously. You've got these little holes in the walls. That is another tower there. For a second there, I thought we came to the wrong place because this is it, but there's a bunch of stairs there too. Yeah, whoa, check this out, Ooh. oh my gosh. Check that view out man, whoa. Guys, we are very high. We're that low. Still got that yet? Yeah. You ready? Yeah. Let's go. Wow, now they start to get steep steps. Yeah. I am actually a little bit scared of heights. I think you've got to like, get through these, this hole somehow. Yeah. Now is when it gets a bit challenging. Because we're outside now. Oh my gosh. Right, oh, it's really windy. Zagiria's waving. Zagiria. They're waving. Oh, oh, wow, look at that view. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm a little bit scared, I'm not gonna lie. But well, I'm not gonna look. Which obviously defeats the whole purpose, but I'm getting tighter. Oh my god, you know what? It's times like this when you think, was well, this a good idea? Shall I just watch what it looks like from the videos? Oh, we got a puddle. We have a puddle here. The video wants to feel the textures. <laughs> you know what? It's a bit weird. It's not that bad actually. I mean, the wind is coming and going like now. Yeah, I it's think not... it's blocked. Yeah, so you just have to uh, keep going. Just look at that, guys. I'm gonna show you the drop. I think we've got a bit of a situation here. Erfan is at a very, very narrow path right now. Very, very tight. Very tight. I don't think we can make it look. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. That was very tight. Zakaria, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Zakaria. Yeah, we're nearly there. It's getting wider. We're nearly there. Oh, 
guarantee it. Just that one bit that was a bit tight, I think. Every corner we turn is just getting tighter and tighter and tighter. This one is even tighter. I can get through, but with Zakaria it's very difficult and it's very scary. Okay, I think we've done it. I think so. I think we're getting there. I mean, I can't see the top anywhere. It's just going round and round and round. I think this is it. Right, I think we nearly made it there. Yeah, this is the top right here. So if you think this is the last bit of stairs, you can't really get around. We made it to the top, but boy oh boy, is it tight and is it windy and is it scary. I don't know if you can see, but the drone is all the way down there because it was so windy. I'm gonna go now and pick it up and hopefully no one's taking it and thank you very much <laughs> so our bag was still there let's see if our drone was still there and when we get down ah, it's so tight it's like yeah he's still waving which means he's in good spirits right so we made it out the dangerous part i am running to see if the drone is still safe and sound i think the drone is there hello little boy is that where you landed your drone? Yeah. I can't believe we did it, guys. <laughs> that was very scary. And I don't know if it's very silly. Let us know in the comments. But listen, you only have one life, innit? I think we've probably shaved off about five years. The kid yeah. not the wiser, by the way. Yeah. He was just like waving. The was literally <laughs> waving no. throughout like, the whole I time. I say, the view from up top is absolutely gorgeous. You can it see is. like this windy road, which you can normally only see by drone shots. But to actually come to the top, and see it is and amazing. See it is so amazing. I'm so glad that we had the whole spot to ourselves because we were panicking, deciding whether should we take the drone or not the drone or whatever. Like, can't fly it. <laughs> I'm used to putting the drone on the floor and flying it out, but I had to do it with my hand this time, and that was very, very <laughs> difficult. Okay, so that's that hike to the top over and done with. It's actually three and a half thousand meters above sea level here, and apparently there's 200 plants which it belongs to about 80 different species in this area. We've made it. Oh, there it is. All right, we're just in a full 360. I thought we were locked in an infinite loop of rooms here. This is why you might be married. Because <laughs> we're just as crazy as each other. Oh my gosh, man. <sighs> if you were to ask me, it's probably one of the most adventurous things we've ever done in our life. Yeah. But if the question is, would you recommend doing it with a little baby? I would honestly say, probably not. Yeah. And it's a good thing that we actually came really early, just after sunrise, because Oh my god, there's so many people going up there now and I cannot imagine coming down that tower packed, sandwiched with a little one. Especially in the tight gaps, you'd have to basically kind of go in those little holes that are in the tower to let people go back and forth, which just makes it uncomfortable. So it pays to come really, really early. It does say online that it opens up at 8.30 and like we said before, if you arrive here just after sunrise, get one of the tuk-tuks up, you can pay 1,500, go early, and just pay for your ticket on the way back. But we've been here for about an hour and a half, half an hour longer than what our tuk-tuk driver said is needed. Shall we go get the tuk-tuk back down? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. There's a moon and a star there, a mosque. Yeah, I think this area is like celebrating the multicultural and multi-faith within the Sri Lankan. I mean, you might be onto something there, fam, because our taxi driver was saying when we were driving through Gampola that this is actually a Muslim area. And now we're going to make our way back to the Tuk Tuk driver. Gosh, this Sri Lanka trip has been so adventurous so far. <laughs> We've done some really crazy things, haven't we? We have. And it's crazy. Only, only just the start of our trip. So make sure you do subscribe to our channel. And we really hope you enjoyed this video, guys. There's loads more videos coming about our adventures that we're taking Zakaria on across Sri Lanka. So keep tuned for that. But for now, guys, make sure you follow your visions. And I mean, we'll see you on the next one. Zakaria says, see you on the next one. Say bye, Zakaria. Bye.